I can't possibly go out there and take pictures of something that is intrinsically be beautiful in itself because it just doesn't hold my interest or my attention at all. This one here is Pond 18. It uh, is interesting for me because it has two contrasting moods. On, on the one hand, there is the sunlight, which makes it um, decepti deceptively bright and, and happy. But it has this air of mystery and darkness brooding in the background. And I really like that. Also, some of the blues that come out here um, make it strange and a bit brooding. The images um, that make up this exhibition are actually a, a series of um, photographs of reservoirs, um, which are really industrial um, constructions uh, um, dotted around an area of Gran Canaria for capturing rainwater. They're, they're in farmlands. And um, I, I was brought up quite um, near this area and spent quite a lot of time as a child in this area. And back, back then, they were in use, most of them. And um, they, they, my fascination for them started right there. Most of them are now not in use. They're um, derelict. And the passing of time has, has created incredible patterns um, on their walls. And um, this is another um, subject that really interests me, how man-made structures decay. and, and become paintings almost. So, so there's layers. There's the, there's the texture layer. There's the um, cropping, which make them look like there is a horizon, so a bit like a, a landscape in itself. But there, there is also this mood that, that, that I want to convey with them. The cropping is very important. It's taking a section of a whole, uh, which immediately produces this sense of puzzlement in the viewer and, and um, so that it's, it's deliberate in, in the sense that you, know, you don't want to give away the whole so that people concentrate on what you're giving them. The whole that you give them becomes a whole yeah. in itself but everybody's aware that it belongs to something wider so it keeps you wondering and looking and, and almost fabricating this possi possible landscape in your head. Something that I try to, to have in, in, in all the works that I do is this um, possibility of keeping the viewer looking for that much longer. And uh, that is, for me, if I achieve that, then I've achieved something.